Measles alert. Six new cases tonight on top of the seven that we learned about earlier. Good evening. I'm Stacy Bell. And I'm David Ushery. Within the last half hour, we've learned six people are confirmed to have measles in Williamsburg. All of the victims are members of the Orthodox Jewish community. They were diagnosed this month. Officials believe an unvaccinated child visiting Israel contracted the disease first and then perhaps brought it back to Brooklyn. All of the patients are children 11 months old to four years old. Five of them were never vaccinated. Now, this is in addition to five primary cases of measles confirmed in Rockland County. There are also two secondary cases, meaning those people got it from one of the five. Eight more suspected cases are currently being investigated. News Force Roseanne Coletti is in Pomona. Roseanne, health officials gave an update this afternoon. What do they say? Well, they were very specific in the update. And one thing you should know is you can come down with the measles anywhere from a few days to a few weeks after being infe infected. And here at the Rockland County Health Department, they are trying to keep track of the outbreak as well as to stem its spread. And this is a high risk situation. Measles is very communicable. The Rockland Health Commissioner urging vaccinations for the unprotected after confirming seven measles cases, five among travelers from Israel, and even more concerning. Two of them are secondary cases. That means they originated from exposure here in Rockland from a primary case. Bella Schwartz, just six months old, too young to receive the measles, mumps, and rubella vaccine. Her mother concerned for her when others go unprotected. You want to do what's you know, safe for your child, but if someone else isn't doing that, then you're kind of, you're worried about your kid getting sick. The most notable sign of measles, a red rash, together with runny eyes, nose, and cough. It can be dangerous, leading to pneumonia, deafness, brain damage, even death. Measles is highly contagious, and one person bringing it into the community can then set off an epidemic among susceptible individuals. The health department currently investigating eight more suspected cases and advising people unsure of their own immunities to contact their doctors, with free immunizations being offered by the county. I don't know why we're still having this. It's supposed to be gone if people are getting their shots and their immunizations and keeping up with it. I don't think we should be having it anymore. Well, it is happening. Now, one thing you should also know, people who were born before January 1st, 1957 are believed to be immune because they were either exposed to the measles or had them as a child. As far as this outbreak, the Rockland County Health Commissioner could not say whether it is over or whether more cases are anticipated. Reporting live from Pomona, I'm Roseanne Coletti, News 4 New York. Roseanne, thank you. We're also